This goes out to Stipe Miocic and Francis Ngannou and all the other fighters in UFC who haven't made nearly as much money as you should because Dana White and his corporation are taking way too much money. How many times are you gonna fight? Are you gonna be retired for the rest of your life like some boxers are, like most boxing champions are? Or are you gonna have to work after you're done and Dana White is driving six Ferraris and doesn't have enough money in his pocket yet, I guess, because he's padding it every fight on your back breaking work. My name is Dan Quinn. I've discovered a miracle, two of them as a matter of fact. The first one led to Diego Sanchez looking like a shredded Mexican Bruce Lee in his fight against BJ Penn, Stevia, blending all the toxic shit out of water before you drink it. Yeah, it's amazing. I'm leaning, I, I can't do that when I'm in here right now, but Stevia by itself is leaning me down and I'm sitting on my ass eating like a pig. The second miracle that I've discovered is the fountain of orgasm for women, gentlemen. Two fingers in and up to the bottom of the G-spot, and now your offhand is pressing down on her belly, below the belly button, feeling those inside fingers, and polarizing and massaging the G-spot at the same time, leads to an orgasm explosion. Then they call me the miracle man. I'm gonna make billions of dollars from pure H2O, blend stevie and water, see it split into a natural gas, stop blending, you'll see it shimmering as water falls down. To recreate pure H2O underneath a huge layer of toxic soap, get all that toxic soap out, and Diego Sanchez is shredded for his fight against BJ Penn and lasts for five rounds of getting his ass kicked. Most guys don't last that long. Most guys cave in, but stevia and the pure H2O that it makes is magic. Bottle up pure H2O and sell it, and it'll have the same effect that it did on my uncle. Knocked off 74 pounds of flabby fat in four months, along with six cancerous breast tumors. Can you imagine that? Across the United States and around the world, a drink that knocked off 74 pounds of fat in four months? Well, it's just around the corner, guys and I'm gonna make a new UFC. You know, we'll name it anything we want to. You know, not the ultimate fighting championships, how about RFC, real fighting cha championships. And where 90% of the profit goes to the fighters who deserve it. 